Hi and welcome, in this video I'm going to show you how to install this nice little Android powered rear view mirror, DVR and reversing camera onto a Vauxhall Astra. So this is the actual device, you can see the touch screen and the rest of the mirror that you can also see me. We also have a GPS module which is external, this is actually just the GPS antenna. 6 meters of cable with which you can connect the reversing camera onto the device and finally the reversing camera itself. I'm going to review the camera in another video, here I'm just going to show you a time lapse on how I actually installed the camera including the GPS module, the reversing camera and the power into this little car. First step was simply mounting the new mirror onto the old one. So the second step is simply just putting the camera onto the tailgate. Third step is removing the reversing light and connect the wires onto the lights. If everything is in order then as you can see the camera has its own bright white LEDs which will also glow. And you should be able to see what's happening behind the car. Next step would be getting the cables across onto the tube. So here I'm just going to remove the tube and try to push the cable through it. In retrospect I think I should have actually done it the other way around but because the jack plug is a bit hard to push through that uh, tubing there but as you can see I do manage somehow it's not that easy but eventually I succeed I'm going to try to put the cables between the top and the uh, frame so here I'm just trying to get them a bit apart and afterwards get the cable through as you can see I managed to get it through and finally just tidy up the cables and install the camera into its final place so basically what I'm not trying to do is move the cable along the consoles and the headlining so between that small part I'm going to move the cables from back to front. The center console was the only tricky part but I had to actually consult the workshop manuals on how to remove it but eventually I succeeded and managed to get the cables through. And the last part is actually getting the cables from the passenger window to onto the top console. Fortunately there is enough space on the top between the console and the passenger window. I just had to use a large enough screwdriver to actually push the cables through. Once that was done I have removed that top console to manage to get the cables through near the window and finally placing everything back to its original place. It was actually quite a bit tricky because I couldn't always find the places to put the screws back but yeah I managed to get it back to its kinda original locations. The last steps included actually putting the GPS antenna to one of its final locations, for me it was near the passenger side window. And finally getting the power cables from the passenger side door onto the center console where I can actually plug it in. So that's it, everything installed and ready to use. Hopefully if you found these instructions at least a little bit helpful. Thanks for watching. I'm going to review the actual device in a different video. Bye.